Welcome back to Just Scribble. I am so excited for this order. I have my first ever order from the Bujo Planner here. This is from her semi-custom sale and I, I cannot wait to open this up. This probably won't be a very long video. This order actually delivered, DHL delivered it at night after we went to bed last night and I had to wait all day till I got home from work so that I could open it up. And I really just want to check it out and share it with you guys. So I probably won't go into a lot of detail on how I'm planning on to use these. You'll see them in future videos, but I did want to open them up because I want to see them and I want to share them. And we'll have more details on them in a future video or two. But this is my first ever order from the Bujo Planner and oh, I'm so excited. So I did order two different planners from her. I ordered one in standard size, that's this one, and one in pocket size, that's this one. I'm going to open up the pocket size first because it was actually my secondary like item. Standard is the thing that I really wanted the most that was like my main item that I had to snag during her sale and I was so excited. And then the pocket was something that I really wanted, but if I couldn't snag one because she sold out, it would have been okay. So we're gonna open this one first and save this one for last. I don't necessarily think it's saving it best for last, but it is saving the one I'm most excited about for last. So that's what we're going to do. Oh my goodness. Okay, so this is a pocket notebook cover, and I did opt to get the two elastics. So, oops, hold on, it's caught. So it does have two elastics and they lay next to each other. It's not like a single strand TN where there's two elastics, but one is shorter. These are the same, they're parallel to each other. They're in this beautiful sort of wine color. So they kind of coordinate with this cover, but they don't match, which I love. So this is her plum purple leather. That is what the base of the cover is. And then I got the two elastics. I decided to get the angled pocket on this one. So it has this angle cut. And then the pocket that I picked is in her platinum leather. So it has this beautiful silver sheen to it. Oh, it is so pretty. I opted not to get a trifle. I'm not a huge fan of trifolds. I have a couple of trifolds and the ones I have I love, but it's not something I want on all of my covers. And then I did opt to get a closure elastic. So I have a closure elastic on there. Oh, it is so pretty. When she did this semi-custom order, you had, I think, six. I think it was six, but you had your choice of your base leather off of the what I think is six. I think there were six options. And then you could pick your pocket cover off of like a ton of options. So you could semi-customize your cover, picking your base and then picking your pocket, picking like what style you wanted and how many elastics you wanted and if you wanted a closure. So this is my pocket smell test it smells so good and i wanted to see real quick let me take this out of here i only have a couple of pocket notebooks i have one from planner monkey co or i think i might have two but it's like the same notebook and then i have this one that i recently shared from sterling ink and i wanted to see if it would slip because i think it will it will so these thicker like half year notebooks that have like 260 to 270 pages they slip in the back and you could put a thicker one too i didn't buy a thicker one but i think the 500 and whatever pages would fit as well but the half year fits really well in there but you can slip that in the back and then you could still use the elastics for a traveler's notebook insert or you could just use it for tn inserts or you could use the lauren phelps design tn sleeve that's what this is. I have videos on those. And you could put the thick notebook in the TN sleeve and then put your other, and then put your TN inserts on that TN sleeve. And then you could use the pockets for like a folder or for ephemera or sticker sheets or whatever you wanted. But I'm so excited that slips in the back because it gives me even more ways that I can use this. And it is so, so pretty. Oh, I am in love. This is gorgeous. <laughs> All right, so that was my second cover that I ordered. And then this was the first one that, that I ordered, the primary one that I was ordering, and the one that I am the most excited about. I don't know if you guys saw my share in the community tab, but I 
cut down a Stalogy to standard size. And I had mentioned when I was doing my health and wellness planner share, I think I mentioned it, that I was planning on doing a standard setup. And I've been waiting to do it until this came in and one other item. So now that this is here, I have almost everything I need. It's so pretty. Oh my gosh, I'm in love. So for this one, I picked her Lux Nude Leather as the base. And then I picked her coral pocket that's got this beautiful suede feel to it. It's so soft with the natural edge, so not angled. And then I got an elastic closure. And then once again, I got the two elastics inside and then it has the pockets. And we're gonna check and see how things fit. And then there's something in here as well. This must be like a little free gift because I didn't order anything else. Oh my goodness. Oh, look. Oh, there's even more in here. This is so exciting. All right, so I got a sticker that has her hashtag on it. And then she sent me some leather samples. Wow, this is so soft. And then this is the coral that I got. Those look really good together. I think, um, I'm trying to remember what the name of this one is. It's this brown, she's been sharing it on her Instagram and some people have been sharing theirs, but it has this really pretty shine to it. I just can't remember what the name of it is. It was one of the options when we picked our bases. And then this one is like a suede gray. This one is a beautiful green, kind of like that brown. This is the Lux Nude, like I got. And then this is like a light lilac lavender. So I got these beautiful samples and my little sticker and my cover. I am so excited. I don't know if I'm gonna leave this closure elastic in it. I have a lot of elastic from Illustring that I absolutely love. It's my favorite shop for elastic. I will try to remember to link a video up above to share with you guys like a haul I got from them. I'm still using elastic from that haul because I bought so much, but I love it. And I think I have some that you, I think I have some that will pull in this coral color. So I may change this out to one of my patterned elastics that has a little bit of color for a pop of color to match that coral. But this is my standard. And I wanted to see, I think I can tuck a notebook in the pocket, but I'm not 100% sure. So this is the Stalogy that I cut down with my paper trimmer. I did share it in the community tab so you guys can check it out. But I mean, it did an amazing job. The grid is so straight. I don't know if that's focusing, but the grid is so straight, perfectly straight on every single page. And this is a happier Stalogy that I cut down and it's so pretty, but I wanna see if it will slip in the pocket. I didn't buy it with the intention of it slipping in. I'm just kind of curious. So it doesn't look like it will, but it's really close. So I might be able to get it to slip in with like a little bit of patience. I may be able to get it to go in there. Like if I loosened up the pocket some. So I think with a little bit of patience, I may be able to get it to slip into the pocket, but I will try that off camera because I really just wanted to unbox these and share these with you guys real quick. And that's not the intention. Like it wasn't, I didn't buy this with the intention of sticking it in. I bought it with the intention of using a Lauren Phelps Designs notebook sleeve with this so that I could put this on the elastics and then I could have this slipped into one of these pockets and then I could have TN inserts in the other pockets. Like this weekly from Sterling Inc. I can slip it into this TN sleeve, but then of course you can use it like a regular traveler's notebook too. So I can also find the center and then slide it on the elastic, put it on there like that as well. And I could do that with the Stalogy as well. I could put it on the elastic, I could make a folder for it, and I may actually be able to slip it in there, but I'm probably gonna use that TN sleeve, but I'm not setting it up right now. I just kind of wanted to show you guys what it would look like. So it kind of looked like that. And then I still have plenty of room for other inserts. So I can put my few inserts and my half year Stalogy for my setup, and it will be slim. And oh, it feels so good. 
I'm so excited. But that's my video. I just wanted to share with you guys because I wanted to open these up and I much prefer to do it with you guys and share it with you guys and give my first impressions and my excitement and so that you can see the beautiful leathers and oh, I am so excited. I do not think this will be my last time to order. I think these are phenomenal and the leathers, I really like her like variety of pocket leathers and the unique combinations you could make. And so I really wanted to kind of go outside the box and make something that was unique and different and not like anything else I had, which is why I went with the platinum for this one and the coral on this one because I wanted them to be just very inviting. And this reminds me of my colors from my channel. So it makes me very happy. But that is my video. I will put the details of what I ordered down in the description box just in case she's doing another semi-custom in the future and you guys want to order so you'll have all that information. She doesn't have semi-custom open all the time and she does also sometimes do full customs and then she also does ready to ship. But stuff isn't available like all the time. So you need to follow her on Instagram or here on YouTube or, or check out her website so that you know when you can do a semi-custom where you get to pick the pieces but you don't get to pick the layout or a full custom where you can fully customize a cover with her, like with different pockets on the interior and things like that, or when she adds it ready to ship. But that's my video. That's my unboxing from the Bujo Planner. I am in love and I am so excited. If you have any questions or comments, please don't hesitate to put them down below and I will definitely get back with you. Give me a thumbs up if you liked this unboxing of the Bujo Planner. Make sure that you're subscribed so you don't miss future videos and don't forget to just scribble.